Sorry, y'all just cut me off when I was talking about the last book I read. It was called Honey and Spice. It was so good. <laughs> <laughs> but hey, we all wear shades of light blue. Well, yours is like yours. Well, I don't know my colors. <laughs> I'm like, what are, what are you doing? I, I wanted to throw the word teal out, but I was like, is that teal or is that teal? That's mint. That's teal. That's mint. That's mint is to get your breath smelling good. Is that? Who that? Okay, so apparently, I was informed. We're watching Scream 6. We're watching Scream 6. I, and I am so excited. I would have dressed for the occasion. You know, brought my little ghost face mask and a, a little, little cloak. Anyway. Wore my nice little shoes. Your boots. My boots. Um, I've been waiting and waiting and waiting to watch this. I never, I don't know. You never what? Never would have I don't know. Better. For some reason, I'm just really into the Scream franchise. And I was this close to going to the movies to see it. You were? Yeah, I really wanted to see it. Without and me? then people talking about it online. I'm like, swipe, swipe. It's time swipe. to lock in. It's time to lock in. So yeah, go ahead, Della. Sorry. Is this the last one? Nah, they get more monies. They get more monies. Kay. Why are you putting... <laughs> Go ahead, man. You got it. We currently have 16,260 subscribers at the time of this recording. Damn, that's a big number. That's a big one for Elmo. <laughs> uh, we are Something Cinema. This video is brought to you by Something Cinema. Sponsored by Something Cinema. Produced by Something Cinema. Featuring Something Cinema. Requesters for this movie. We have Junior, Tyrell Grant. Chase Jones, Kenny the Inevitable, Halima Halima, Halima Halima, 1966 Fastback, Flashback, Fast, JD Scopes. Why you do that to me? What is that? Fastback. It definitely is fast. That definitely says fast. That's not even the worst one that If there was you Flash... Read. There would have been an L. L. Yeah. Your patron. Tribute. I'm dyslexic, okay? Uh, no, yeah, you read Wait. so often, and so it's just fast. Like, you just. I do be reading like, it fast. Wait a minute. Everything's up. just like that. And then once you read it, you're like, wait, that didn't make sense. Let me go back. On intentions. On no, top. They got intentions by Justin tri- Bieber. I'm finished. Go. Oh. <laughs> go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. For the third time, thank you to our patron. Trey John, we appreciate you for being a patron. Thank you, Trey. Is that one word? Trey yeah. John? Trey John? Why well, can't I call you Trey? Would you rather be drowned by a siren or abducted by an alien? Wait. You gonna say alien? You gonna say alien? I'm gonna say alien because that's not a for sure death. Okay. Alien, only because this, that water. Yeah, I don't I'm not dealing drowned. with that. Uh, would you rather wish on a star or wish on a birthday cake? Do all the wishes come true? That's not what the end, that's not what the question says. Cake, cake. <laughs> <laughs> cake, 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 cake. Would you ride in, rather ride in a rocket or ride in a submarine? Rocket, rocket, rocks, mm, rocket. Rockets blow up, submarines be underwater. You choose submarine? I'm, I'm going rocket. You got, yeah, Don't mine rockets right. Rockets blow up? Not all of them. It's time, um, to, it's time to lock in. Do you remember how the last one ended? It was a tall guy. It was homie's son. Not, you know. But a lot of them survived. The I do remember that. The twins that were Randy's kids. The, yes. The twins survived. I forgot about I that. I think there was two more no, girls that one survived. girl didn't survive. What girl? The, the one that the friend shot. Because she was like, no, I'm the killer. Bah! Who? No, the cop. The cop lady. Judy. Her son died, right? She died Wells. too. Wells. Wallet. Mm. Yeah, she died no. too. Wait, what? Wes. Wes. Sure. No, it's Wes. It's Wes. Yeah, so. I might have said Wale first, but it's Wes. <laughs> Dang, man. I think there was, a, I think it was. He I died in the was, shower? After he the died shower. at the house. Yeah. Out, out the shower. But didn't the mom die? The mom died too. Because remember, he was left alone at the house. She was Mom was sushi. coming back. With sushi. She died at the house, too. She died getting out the car trying to get to him and go. Right. She was the one that was giving, uh, do we want a bra- brownies? Lemon bars. Who that? 
the girl from Ready or Not. You know, I was gonna say she kind of looked like Margot Robbie. Oh. oh. Um, can I call? Hi, hi, Reggie. Laura, hi. Hello. No problem. Uh, well, this is what I get for picking a trendy place with no sign up front. Huh? <laughs> Am I on Hudson? I don't know. I am not on Hudson. Shit. <laughs> Film studies. That's <laughs> cool. Oh. You say that, but try teaching a class on 20th century slashes to a heap of hungover 19 year olds. <laughs> What's she slashes, huh? Okay, they got one Hudson. Okay. Um, what color is the outside of the restaurant? I, I think it's red. Yeah, it's definitely red. Yeah, I'm not seeing anything red here. Sure, you're on Hudson? Um, ah, crap, I'm still a block over. Uh, Girl, you better not go in the alley. Yes. Yes, there is an alley. Oh, perfect. Okay, I'm coming down the alley. Why Girl. would you wait in the restaurant? He's a grown ass man. He can walk wherever he want to go walk. He got laws, he go fix it. You don't even sound like he's walking. Can you, can you wait? Can you sit here? Uh, the person I'm looking at isn't waving. They're just staring at me. Are you okay? Oh, shit. Why are you he's doing that? Me. I don't, I don't see anybody. Who are you, you can't fight? What are you gonna do? The worst part is, you teach a class about slashers, and you still walked into a dark alley, alone. He gonna catch her now? No. <laughs> now run! <laughs> okay. Damn, that's a beef with that. Right, what did I do to you? Did I give you an F? Damn! The fact that she was able to spray. Yeah, 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 yeah. Is it in your mouth through the little? Shut up. Yeah. You gonna lift the mask? Blash, what are you doing Wait. here? Oh, hey, Tara. Listen, are you and Greg gonna come to the OKV OK party? Well, if he finishes the Spanish project in time, yes, we will. Is your sister coming? No, Sam. What have you got dinner at that party? Oh, he about to get killed. Right. Got a little shrine. You gonna clean that, right? He gonna die. I'm sorry, okay? I I just got massive blue balls and I had to practice. Oh, I'm not mad, Jason. Dude, you said we wouldn't use the voice on each other. Greg did. <laughs> Reverse little car. Where, else would it be? Where are you? I want to tell you about it. And seriously, turn off the fucking voice modulator. I'm just trying to get the voice right. You got to have your practice, I get mine. When the knife went in her, it's like she wasn't human anymore. Just an end. She gave me a C minus on my jello paper. Is that why you killed her? Because of the C minus? Who's next here? Great school vice principal? Why won't you tell me where you are? Why do you keep asking me that? I already told you. Let's play a game. Mm, I don't play games. Nope. He in the fridge. I don't want her. I don't wanna play. That's not your friend. Aren't they together? I'm gonna hang up now. But you're getting warmer. You was just in there. Warmer. You're on fire. Damn. When I said he was in the fridge. That's not what I meant. We have to finish the movie. Who gives a fuck about movies? So how are the new meds treating you? Okay. This is what therapy I'm in that. You've been coming here for six months now, and what we've really spoken about is how your sister isn't dealing with whatever happened to both of you. If I'm going to help you, um, I, I, I need you to give me the details. I feel like as a therapist, you wait for your client to be ready. My father was Billy Loomis. He was a famous serial killer. I made a movie about him. Last year, I found out that my boyfriend was also a serial killer and only dating me because he idolized my father. And when I got out that I'm Billy's daughter, this crazy rumor started online that I orchestrated the whole thing and framed them. Okay, and how, how did you stop him? Well, I stabbed him 22 times and slit his throat. It felt right. It's, yeah, it do. Somebody trying to stay at you. No, you said give you details. I'm just... No, no, I, I, I'm not equipped to deal with this kind of... Uh, Bullshit, Dr. Stone. <laughs> nah, he not. Hey, Rich Kara, why aren't you texting me? 
Who are you supposed to pick up when I call? I got out of therapy early, so I was thinking maybe we cook dinner tonight. Now, Ghostface chasing your ass, so you got four locks to undo. You did. But they already inside, and you gotta undo five locks just to get out. Have you seen Tara? <laughs> Where's Tara? She went to the Omega Kappa Beta party. I begged her not to go to that, and we've now arrived at that. <laughs> Ooh, this cute boy shirtless. Yeah. Well, Always you. Creepy, creepy, creepy looking. Okay. I'm gonna go find Tara. Okay, be right back. Bye. No, I think of it like being struck by lightning. The odds of it happening twice to the same person are extremely low. Oh. Mm -hmm. This camera shot can't even give both y'all the same. Tara? I got a bottle of Fireball from my room. No, thank you. Yeah. Tara! You want to call it a night? No, uh, I think that I'm actually still going to hang, but you guys don't have to wait for me. Then we start making moves. Yeah, get you out there. Introduce you to some girls. What about her? <laughs> what is his costume? Because I said Shrek and nobody said nothing else. Does she have a, a knife on the side of her hat? Tara's good down here. Sorry, but I didn't catch it. <laughs> yeah, you did. Oh! Oh! Get the fuck off! The the we, yeah, yeah. Huh? we all done went you through some shit. We all staying together. Thank you. Not letting me go up those stairs. Mm -hmm. So why does Sam don't get a thank you? Survivors gotta stick together. And besides, you can do a lot better than date rape Frankie. If Sam that is his married. actual nickname, why is he not in jail? Don't get too close. He gonna die. Right. I mean, he survived the last one. He he know how to fight now. Oh, Girl, how you go? What did you need? My phone. So. Don't ever enter a room like that. I won't. Yeah. No, it's I'm gonna go, but get some rest, get sober, and please don't kill your sister, okay? She loves you very much. Neighbor <laughs> Bay or Creeper Stalker? I know who you are. I know you didn't kill him. Are you waiting for him? Oh, y'all, say no. Oh. So no words are needed. <laughs> right. Okay. Okay. Danny. One. Oh, so you know his name. help it if my kink is woman who's ashamed that you've seen with me? Come on. Oh, you know, it's not that. Being famous isn't all it's cracked up to be. Hey. And Tara's pissed at me. Again. Yeah, family can be rough. Sam! Get up here right now. Jason Carvey and Greg. Holy Lord. shit, that's that chode from our film studies class. The one obsessed with our agenda. Also found on the scene were various ghost-based costumes. I'm like, bitch, they have fucking you, we gotta be vigilant, this bitch. What are you doing? Hold, hold on, come on. No, wait, let's what are you doing with that knife? Because this this might not have anything to do with us. Are you serious? Look, Quinn, your dad's a cop, right? Can you call him and find out what's going on before you make the unilateral decision to abandon my college education and flee the fucking state? Don't answer that. Why you, Why is that your ringtone? Huh? Huh? Why is it not some hot, happy pop song? Why? Is, why does it sound like a home phone? Why did everyone just freak out when her phone rang? 
You got to keep up, my dear. Sam? How many people are you? I was actually just about to call you. Have you? Well, my sister thinks I'm probably overreacting. No, unfortunately, you're not. Why is it a ringtone? That don't bother y'all? No. Oh, hell no. Is he dead? Yeah. Yes. I deleted his contact. Hello, sir. <laughs> Did you miss me? Don't know what you think long and hard about whether you really want to do this because the last two people that fucked with us ended up dead. Jason and Greg were going to kill you and your sister. Why would that be him? I gutted them before they had the chance. Are you protecting us now? Not quite. I'm going to show the world who you really are. A liar and a killer. You and Tara better watch your backs. You better watch yours. Oh, shit. Okay, Tara. I'm saying you better take some defense class. Happy You're Halloween. That's, that's, I can't tell. Is that man talking? Oh, shit. That's not real. That's not real. It's real? I'm, nobody giving a can of whoop ass. Damn. You missed. He does. He about to stab you. You got so much reaction time. What the fuck? So we got security cameras up in here, right? Nah, nah, Ghostface got a gun? How many rounds is in that bitch? Where the cops at? Y'all. I'm way too stressed. We could have been did that! Now the cops show! Fuck everybody in this bitch. He gonna get the keys and go out the back. Damn, you got the keys that fast? Bridget Kirsch. Is that ringing up? Don't lie. We're familiar with him. <laughs> but the one that attacked us had a different mask on. Do you have alibis for earlier tonight? I was at a party with my friends. I was at my therapist's. So if the man who attacked you did steal your license and plant it next to the body, it would probably be somebody close to you. Ethan, Annika, Austinson. I think I can vouch for Quinn, so that's one less we have to worry about. How? FBI's here. Claiming jurisdiction. Where are they? Hmm. Special Agent Kirby Reed. Kirby. Yeah. One kind of deal in office. Hmm. Kirby? Hey, Sam. Y'all met? What? Damn, everybody just short? You're the FBI. I'm sorry. She just told. Look, I'm not trying to get into a jurisdictional pissing contest here. I just want to help. I'll show you mine, etc. <laughs> Is this the mask he was wearing when he attacked you? No. It's misleading them on purpose. Which means whoever's doing this is a student of the killers who came before. Look at my shirt. Does it look like I killed anybody? Bitch. Oh. Oh. Nice try, sweetie. So I've done this dance before. Oh. <laughs> Are you really still mad at me? You said you wouldn't write a book about what happened. And then you wrote a book about what happened. Oh, Getting a repeat. What would you think? Isn't Dewey dead? That's a low blow. So was your book. You called me unstable and a born killer. Hey, I talked to Sydney. So? She's you... not coming here, is she? No. Gail just cares about number one. I this fucker as much as you do. Maybe. Or maybe you're just afraid that without ghost face in your life, you're gonna fade away. Why well, I gotta die? He knows too much. He wore a full set of pajamas with no socks. That's a big place. You got money. No thing. Being early for trick or treating, you know. Ew! Strong arming, are we? That mask is dirty. Okay, the way I see it, someone is out to make a sequel to the recall. Um, what's a recall? Heroes now in college. Check. Suspicious new characters brought in to round out the suspect list and or body count. Check, check, and check. But we're not in a sequel because nobody just makes sequels anymore. He taking notes? We're in a franchise. If the killers last time were whiny snowflake film nerds with letterboxed accounts instead of personalities, you can bet the opposite will be true here. The worst <laughs> part is franchises are just continuing episodic installments designed to boost an IP, which means main characters 
are completely expendable now, too. Okay, wait, what, why am I on the suspect list? Because I'm randomly Chad's roommate? Roommate lotteries can be jukes. Yeah. A slutty roommate. A horror movie? Classic. And you know we vetted her, plus her dad is a cop. And that makes it more likely that she's the killer because having a cop dad is a great cover. Do you not remember how these movies work, Tara? The point! <laughs> Bitch, never trust the love interest. Right. You a suspect too, bitch. What about you guys? I mean, I think it's pretty safe to rule out the four of us who went through this last year in Woodsboro. The pain you got from the killings made you thirsty for more. Mm, I mean, no, thank to you. be honest here, some of the theories online about Sam are... Don't you fucking dare. I mean, Damn, it's not Tara's gotten a little homicidal. It's us. the big eyes, for real. <laughs> it's the void. It's the eyes. She been clocking people left and right. She got big eyes, too. You gotta stop with the big eyes, okay? Another mask was found at the scene. It's a DNA match for Roman Bridger. The ghost face who was directed in Stab 3. Last year was Amber Freeman and Richie Kirsch, whose mask we found at the first crime scene. Roman Bridger was the only single ghost face. Kudos to him for ambition. Life. His mask was found at the Shrinks. Which just leaves Mickey Altieri, Nancy Loomis, Stu Mocker. And Billy Loomis. You call the Atlanta field office. Dig up what you can on Agent Reed. You know, considering what happened to you last time, I I wouldn't blame you if. That's a nice color blue. I don't think I'm going anywhere. Uh, uh, well, you two just make out already? Mindy, that is so inappropriate. Oh, well, whatever. This will be so fun. A little slumber party with the core four. Core four? Yeah. Did you just give us a nickname? Well, I sure did. Up top. No. Don't, don't get that away from me. Please, for the love of God, don't do it. You know, I would actually like a little more respect oh, and support. Oh no, something's gonna happen. Can y'all release that? That's the Matt Carpenter, one of the survivors of the Woodsboro killing. You wanna see an attack? I'll give you an attack. See if it was me? See, that video would be a lot longer. You could play that video if homegirl died. That ain't the person that died. I know you're not a fan of the way that I've been handling things. And that I've been giving you a really hard time. But I can say that. None of us can relate to what you are experiencing. And I know I shouldn't care what people think. It just sucks being this hated. Okay, we have all been through some fucked up stuff and we are coping with it differently. We are the core fucking folk. Thank you very much. I that's hate that's you. Right. <laughs> that's what I'm talking Hers about. Hers is better. She had a more for. Yeah, I know she's my roommate, but you're like the police. Your no walls can't be that big. Hey, man, what's up, bitch? Fuck it! I'm paranoid. Throw something out the window. Yo, iron! And don't use my good feet. <laughs> he bet. She don't even claim me. Answer it. Answer it. Answer the fucking no, fuck. I'll call him back. No! Gentlemen, call her back at it again. Uh, Who said what that? the fuck? <laughs> but she didn't see Ghostface walk by. Oh, who gonna tell the dad? Her daughter did. His daughter did. Oh, you bitch! Who gonna fuck him up? Chad, you out? Oh, he a bitch. I'm, ooh. Oh, you got two for two. Y'all gonna let him kill? Oh! Not the dead girl. Where your boyfriend at? He was with the shits. Come on, Danny. Chad is guilty as a motherfucker. Chad, you a bitch for that. Who is that man? Don't, don't. Not he's fall. Gonna stab the, he's gonna stab the door. Please don't. Damn, Damn that's a hard ass fucking kid. You ain't ready. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. She not gonna make it. Who not gonna make it? Oh, girl in the green, Annika. Oh yeah, she ain't got a lot of blood or anything in her body. She gone. I don't trust him. Not even as a killer. I just don't trust him. This man. Oh, you better fight through it, girl. Fight through it. You better not fucking die. Go out the other door, Annika. Oh, you did, girl. You better do it. You right behind could have been right behind. Ah, 
shit. Ain't nobody said look back. Look back at it. Don't, 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 don't do that though. All you gotta do is just. Oh, he about to. Oh. There's four motherfuckers holding this ladder. He can't be that motherfucking big and strong. There's four motherfuckers. That's how I do. This isn't your fault. Son. It's yours. But it is. Damn, I really thought they was gonna be able to get through a sleepover. Where's the other boy? The Ethan. Hey, why you talk like that? He got a little accent, but my thing is, you no, don't know. Yo, nah, he been talking like that. Uno, uno. He could, he, he been could do that. like that since she hoped. Where the fuck were you? Now you wanna fight? To what nah, I'm now here. you want to fight? I, I had econ, you know this. Bullshit, man, you disappeared, my sister almost could kill. Well, where's Quinn's daddy? I'm so sorry. Step the fuck back. You're at the top of my list. Oh, oh shit. He about to come at her. Super foul. He about to be like, this all your fault. His walk just, damn. He just he lost his fucking I know, I'm saying, I can see it. I can I, I see it in the, ooh. Well, my kids are gone. Both? Oh, yeah, she said she had a brother. I'm not gonna stop until I find you. You fuck with my family. You die. You okay? I came as soon as I heard. Dale, I swear to God. No, truce, okay? I'm, I'm here for whatever you need. You're the cop, right? Oh, hey, I did some digging on your first two victims and I found something. I know where the masks are coming from. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. I see that. I see it. I see it. Oh, Drew Barrymore's phone. Fuck the whole goddamn no. franchise. I will burn all of it. How much of that did Gail get Chad, stabbed? Hmm? This oh. is Uncle Randy. You see you. Aww. They've got everything. A oh, lot yeah. of Vic up. Vic Gail, you got your own little case. And do we? You gonna sign him? Aww. Why is that the picture they use? <laughs> you look a little drunk. The killer must have found this place before he murdered Jason and Greg, and then he took the masks off the mannequins. God damn, how fucking cool is this place? Oh, hell no. Fuck yes. Come on, Sam, you gotta be excited to get our murder on again. We don't need to be connected, I'm sorry. Your fingerprints all on that glass. What are you doing? Leave a fingerprints? I hear you're a horror fan. It's been set. Mm -hmm. Best Nightmare on Elm Street. The original. Psycho 2 is underrated. Candyman, the original or equal? Both. Okay, yeah, the requel was really good. Game recognized game. Where's your mother in all this? That's a good question. She cut me off when I told Tara about Billy. Then Tara cut her off because she wouldn't talk to me, so my parents suck too. But you can still make your own family. Is that why you suck? Even if it's just with one person. Who's your one person for family? How'd you get past what happened to you? You don't. I almost died after I was stabbed. I didn't want to spend the rest of my life being afraid of monsters. I wanted the monsters to be afraid of me. I like that. You should have stayed with the others. It's not gonna happen. One of them is a killer. Point and both of us putting ourselves at risk. I don't trust that van. Okay. So we're really doing the phone tracing thing that never works in the movies. It'll be all, keep him talking, Sam. Two more minutes. I've almost got him. This is exactly how our Uncle Randy died. In the Broken. van, too. Public place. Yanked into a van. On the phone with Gail. No more Randy. Hmm. Who is paying his phone bill? Ghostface got money? For a mastermind, you're not very bright. Waiting for me to call, desperately hoping I'm nearby so the police can grab me. I'm a step ahead. Be seeing you, Samantha. He's inside an apartment building halfway across the city. On West 96? How did you know that? Who's a permanent Okay. Get in. Can what you drive? You got? Can you drive? Can, go ahead. Can you see over the steering wheel? What do you think you're doing? That's an official vehicle. Who is it? Yeah, let's just call him, please. Let's put it back. He says it's the killer. Hello, Gail. 
Wait. Strange that you and I have never spoken on the phone. Let me see. So, what's your motive this time? Are you angry at the movies, or are you just trying to stay relevant? Well, I could ask you the same. Or maybe you deserve to be punished for all that money you made off the misery of others. Maybe it's time someone made a buck reporting your death. It never works out for the dipshit in the mask. Oh, he got your man oh, that quick. They certainly leave a mark before they go, don't they? You're not How does it feel to lose the only man who ever loved you? Fuck you. Wasn't that the man in the How room? does it feel to know that you weren't there for him at the end? You couldn't stop what happened to Dewey. Just like you're not going to be able to stop this. <laughs> Damn. Why you got her man like that? None of these men can fight. Nobody can fight except Je Jenna, Tara. He do it. Ooh. Bam. Brick ball. Nah, wait a damn minute. Did you drop it? That was your weapon. If he was killing your mans, who was on the phone with you? Huh? 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 We doing a house tour or what? Somebody was on the phone with you. He wearing a, a bulletproof something, Gail. Yeah, I mean, he was. You're not stupid. You missed. Then sure I did. Or maybe I'm wearing a bulletproof vest. That's why I'm gonna shoot you in the fucking head. You never got to be the leading lady, did you? It was always all about poor sweet Sydney sucking up all the oxygen. That's Can you cool. hold, please? Stab, then, then reveal. Oh, and... oh, shit. That's why y'all gonna be dead. I'm not dead. dead. I would have kept that frying pan and beat his ass. Come on, man. <laughs> why is he speeding? He Batman. Stay alive, girl. You can't die. She got stabbed three times, bro. Tell Sydney. Never got me. But you about to die. Mm -hmm. Okay. I'll go back. Y'all a little late, huh? Hey, Gail's a fighter. She might be in the hospital by then, you know? She be doing that. She be doing that. Hopefully she stopped writing books, though. <laughs> I'll just give myself up. If this is what I have to do to keep you safe, it's worth it. Every single day you make the decision to protect me. None of us would even be alive if it weren't for you. Oh, we're in danger. You have to let us protect you this time. We're family. Let's go. Core four. Come on. Core four. Core what? It's an us thing. <laughs> we want to lure him to a secure location and trap him inside. He right then there. What? We execute him. And your phone tapped. So we just need a lot from the killer who picks us off one by one. Hey, oh, He ignored his sister. Oh, shit. Don't get separated! Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Mindy, <laughs> fucking bitch! Get your ghost face ass away from me, ghost face. Let's go away. Let's go away. She missed the train. I was gonna wait for her, but cute boy here dragged me on. Let's try to keep us together. Stop pulling us apart. It's okay, it's okay. Is that Mike? And ghost face! And Mike! And 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 and, and, and. Freddy. Freddy. Yeah, bitch. Yeah, bitch. If you one see a dirty these, ass one, one of these is gonna be dirty. And, and, and if it's them. dirty as hell, got a problem. Ethan, you fucking creep. Check his backpack. He could just know who you are. Ah, see, I don't like this. Get where you had to go, huh? She gonna die. Randy had to die. Ooh, I don't like where you standing. 
You couldn't just pick a seat. Oh, I would be having anxiety. There's somebody behind you. He oh, moving closer. He getting closer. Get closer. He get closer. Can I help you? I know she kept moving away from Ethan, but oh, there you go. Yeah. Nobody see this? You that sleep? I'm not gonna lie, I sleep kind of hard. Not in public like that. You no. do. Not in public. Somebody say, call the police, something. You're gonna be okay, you're gonna be okay. God damn it. Looks like I'm running again. What the fuck? Help, call. Where are Mindy and Ethan? The five minutes behind us. No, they're not. Me and So, this is the only way in or out. He steps in through the first door, both doors lock automatically, trapping him inside. You know you're not safe here. Whenever someone says we're safe here, it means you're not. Not now. You're smarter than this, Sam. My thing is, why are we choosing a location that this ghost face knows better than us? I hate your ring tone. Sound like a freaking lamb. Hello? Get everyone out of there, Sam. You're not safe. What are you talking Who's about? They fired Kirby two months ago for being mentally unstable. What? She's no longer with the FBI. You said it. Sorry, you can, you can have them. They don't, just, don't no, eat them all that If you want them, you have them. We don't want these. Ah, fucking Chad. I actually... Mm-mm. <laughs> Damn, Kirby! Right. It was easy to juke the roommate lottery. This was your grandmother's, Sam. Nancy Loomis. Really runs in fucking family, doesn't it? Hey, roommates. You didn't see that one coming, did you? Absolutely. Yeah, because you died. You kind of didn't. Though, it was a good way to get off the suspect list. That's number three. That's two. Which leaves your father's. They're still not getting it. Look, I don't know what you believe, but I didn't commit those murders in Woodsboro. It wasn't me. Oh, we know that. Come on. Who do you think started the rumors about you in the first place? You're a killer. Just like your father. No, I'm not. Yes, you are, you motherfucker. You killed our brother. Oh, Richie? At the hands of your bitch sister. Oh, because y'all was paying his phone bill. <laughs> that, now it makes sense. She never well, how the fuck was I supposed to know that? She never saw pictures or anything? Or... Her boyfriend at. Come kill his ass. Where's Kirby? There she is. Where, you got your knife girl? Start There's stabbing her. Have I maybe overindulged Richie's love of these little movies? Yeah. Maybe. But. Richie really loved them. Which is why I helped him build this collection. This was all his? Yes, he's a very passionate collector. I built a tribute to my son. 
Which is why this is where you have to die, Sam. Pathetic. <laughs> is that true? Yeah, your son. He was a man baby who made his girlfriend do all the killing. Shut the fuck up! Yeah, bam! Yeah, again. Reverse Uno, bitch. Hello, Detective Bailey. I've got one question for you. What's your favorite scary movie? <laughs> That's two shots. You only get what? Oh. I see you put on your true face. Right, I'm a fucking police officer. How do you think this is gonna go, Sam? Who do you think they're gonna believe? Huh? Probably the one who's still alive. No, no! Not even going for the juggler, just arms. So I did your Sun 22 and you 42. He's gonna, he's gonna pop up. Somebody's gonna pop up. Somebody needs medical. Thank you for letting me go. Sure. Sh 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 you, you got stabbed in the process, but okay. I know you could take care of yourself. Shh. Sh I want to be in your life, but only as much as you want me to be. I want you to be. I promise you, I'm gonna get so much therapy out of it. Yeah. I'm serious. I don't know. Thank you, Kirby. In a scary movie once. The original <laughs> title of Scream was supposed to be Scary Movie. Yeah. Oh, now you know to call the cops. Now, where were your antennas when I was in here getting my ass whooped? <laughs> and I called Mount Sinai and Mindy and Gail are going to be okay. And he's on the way here now. Please well, tell me the brothers are going to keep going. She did all that in a crop top. You ever need me? Call. We're all part of the same fucked up family now. It better not be your fucking dad. It's you better survive, Chad. That happened to him last time. No, not just therapy. You might need a psychologist. No, she got the knife. You got. You need a. You need a little. You need a little some medicine. My thing is, I was thinking about it. First of all, no. <laughs> Who paid his phone bill? Was I wrong? You gonna look at me and tell me I'm wrong? I, didn't say that. <laughs> I called that shit off the first call. Who was paying his phone bill from a year ago? Only family could do that shit. Did I say that in part, extra part? No, I know I get what you're, I know what you're I, I'm like, I was picking up what you was putting down. Thank you. Okay. My thing is, so Sydney in Scream, number one, Billy tried to kill her because of her mom sleeping with his dad. No, because she broke up his family. 
What? Wait, what? Billy was... Remember, he's like, your whore mom or something. Mm-hmm. Okay. My only thing is... So this one... I like that they tried to kill it because they was like, yeah, Richie was my son. You got him killed. We just ignoring the fact that your son was homicidal first. Crazy. Right. Crazy concept. Well, no, this is... They're literally copy and pasting. They're literally copy and pasting. The it's mom, a little bit of... Yeah, and, too. and in the second one, that's what happened because the mom was the... Second was one. the was well she was the killer killer and then she yeah. got mickey on board well, when, i started seeing where it was going when she got the call from the the dead ghost face from the first one and when they she? were walking and you was like uh, wait how are you paying the phone bill when you when, when she was getting the dead phone or the phone call from the ghost face from the first one i was like okay it's obviously family ties now <laughs> now who's the family ties in the, in into this? So I caught when the roommate said, "Oh, my dad followed me to New York." Like talk about soccer. transferred to the NYPD. Yeah, well, that not, was my first. That's the that one didn't get me when when he said that he lost his son too. And she I said, said I "Okay, lost my brother." I said, "Okay." Now I'm 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 kind of putting all all those I things definitely together. Got What's the name was already sus like. Ethan? When when you go off of... Because I don't know why you kept saying it was going to be one of the core four that's killing. I don't know why. Chad but, was a punk bitch for leaving his sister. I'm going to get to the Chad character. We I'm going to get, get to the Chad character. He but but I, I don't know why. Once, once you've seen the... Uh, it was only three suspects with them, right? For the core four, then three new people. Mm-hmm. Once the other two went, I was like, okay. He, it's definitely him. So I thought it was just... Them too. I thought it was just... Um, yeah, them two. Because I knew, the cops? I knew, I knew it was two, mm-hmm. and I knew it was two because when they were going after uh, Gail, somebody was on the phone. Yeah, somebody's on the phone. So I'm like, okay, it's two, and I and I didn't think it was a girl because, like you said, it, it was. They were all grown man strength. Yeah, it throw was it too out much stuff. her boyfriend. No, when he picked the girl up, that he's the, the the one that we don't know her name, the girlfriend, Mindy's girlfriend. Yeah, yeah. When he picked her up like that. I said, no, no, no. Yeah, That's I, a she grown was man. <laughs> it don't matter. Yeah, nah. Ethan I, I, wasn't going to be able to pick I, her I up like that. that. part. My fault. Ethan, no. He he didn't have that he type of strength. Strong. Like, he yeah, was he could, strong. He could stab too. somebody but or like slice an arm. But no, he wasn't He wasn't doing the throwing around or none of that. He was big. All right, let's, let, let's get to Jack. Because I feel like this in the first one. That character does nothing. That character does nothing. And I was mad that they made that character a love interest oh. to this movie. I was mad. I thought he was going to have to provide something. It, I, I just like, man, come on. Like, he was just there. Yeah, it's, it, it doesn't, he, he doesn't really add anything to these things, like to these the movies. Story. He tries like, to add like the jokes and like comedic relief, but it's like, but you know you're what? pissing it's, me off when you got. Well, him, the fir- him and Mindy are a pack- package deal. Basically. Well, it's the first, the first one he had a little more value because he was that guy. Like, yeah. the comic relief. Really, this one you just made him completely the love interest, and it just it's just forced, like it's forced love interest. I'm like I don't I don't really, I don't, I'm not really feeling this. One thing I think that they're doing that's really really good that I hope they keep doing for this franchise, you got to keep them alive because Randy is like one of the best characters in the franchise, and he goes early, Real like really early. So to keep them two in it, I think it's like... I think it's cool. It's really dope. Like, it, it's really dope. Listen, you got to keep them alive. I think my one thing about this movie is, yeah, you can't always have Cindy in it. Sydney. 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 Not Cindy, Sorry. girl. Sydney. But stop calling her back. Like, tell Sydney he didn't get me. I think it's like a, I think a it's homage cool. and a little no, respect. No. I think she it's cool. It. Okay, I have beef with that because... They she's didn't, not in it? Because she's not in it, and they didn't want to pay her what she's worth. It's like she's carried the last five movies. That's why she's not in it? Yeah. yeah. Oh, I thought she just didn't want to be in it. No. They didn't want to well, pay her to They didn't want to pay her what she was worth. Oh, Literally, that, that, that's That's a slap in the face. Because, yeah. I mean, no disrespect to Jenny Ortega or whatever, but I started this. You don't have to pay me. That's like, uh, what's the name? Having Lori, like, having Jamie Lee Curtis not be in Halloween. I understand what you're saying, right? Which, mm-hmm. you know, pay her what she's worth. Obviously, they're going to a new, a new franchise. Well, they're extending the franchise with new characters, so mm-hmm. it's mostly going to be about them mm-hmm. than the original. 
characters. So I understand, like, even, like, last one, What's His Name Dies. Dude. Then this mm-hmm. one, she, uh, Gail's not even in it as much. Like, you, you're, you're transitioning to these characters. Um, so it is kind of like, dang, it, it is kind of messed up. At the same time, I look at it as, like, building a franchise. And now that we we're building a franchise, we're in our sixth movie, it's obviously going to keep going. Then it's like, you're the foundation of it. You're, you're going to get paid based, just based off how many movies we do. So, like, yeah, you may have not got paid as much as you wanted, but understand that movie and that revenue is going to keep coming because we're going to keep, we're going to make seven, eight, not like they're going to keep trying to go on and on. I'll with this. only forgive it if they bring her back. Well, I mean, they, I think they left the door open with just acknowledging her character, mm-hmm. but I, I just want, I don't, I don't know what they're doing with this whole possession thing. I don't know what they're doing. Not the best. Like <laughs> psychoanalyst. Psych- like, psychotic. Like, I don't know what they do with this whole possession thing. She sees visions. Okay, so... Like, they gotta make... Like, a bit, now I'm thinking, okay, you gotta make her just go ham. Like, you gotta make her lose her mind. And she gotta be the next killer. And, and yeah. Like, mm-hmm. either she's gotta be the next killer, or she, you she, you gotta walk her off the line of killing. And I think the next movie would be dope, because if she does start going into that, now you can bring back... uh, What's her name? And have her go after her, because she's getting those... Sydney? Those, those visions. Oh, my dad again. told me to kill you. Right. Like, now you're getting those. Because they're trying to make Billy seem like a cool guy. And he was not. Like, yeah. okay, so you know what I'm saying? Cool like, they, they're trying to make him seem like he cool. He the was not that. That Richie's dad was okay with him being a serial killer, but then wanting to kill her because she killed him. It's like, and then you get your kids on board. Y'all just crazy. My this thing is, is the water. He had them training. She killed her little boyfriend. Or maybe she didn't. I don't know. But they her was... Little, her little... Uh, every time we saw Ghostface... Motherfucker got punches in. Yeah. Motherfucker was fighting. My issue. My issue. We got all these beefed up men up in here. Can't none of them fight. None of them. None of them. Chad, he get one punch. We're not talking tired. about Chad. He tired. We're not, we're not talking about the I just need to get off my chest real quick. Chad's real quick. Real quick. If I had a twin, that other half, and you pull the girl who ate your girl out, and leave your sister to get stabbed? And got the nerve to call us core motherfucking fool? Well, they're, Fuck you! They're, they're, they're twins, so he was thinking, you I got grabbed my bitch? boo. No, no, no. I grabbed my boo, you grabbed yours, but they didn't, they didn't get that memo. <laughs> she didn't, it didn't transmute. She didn't, she didn't nah. process that. Nah, he left her then. Daddy, her little boo thing with the little accent, um, beef. Because how you gonna stand in your windowsill? She didn't pick up the phone. You watching somebody die. I would have or no, he didn't even watch window. her. He didn't watch her die, huh? She's being haunted, but you know the the twins are the Randy characters for a split, right? Mm-hmm. So mm-hmm. instead of killing them off, it's and um, what's her name? Kirby's Dewey, right? Gail, but then we have but we have the we have the two girls. So the two girls, one is like them two. You know what I mean? So I I see what's happening, but it's keeping them alive, like. That's the thing that I like, is keeping them alive. At the same time, it gets predictable because next movie, you're going to bring people in, and then you're like, okay, y'all going to die. Who's Ghostface now? Mm-hmm. Like, that's that's going to be the thing of, which I guess all the movies are kind of like that when you think about it. But, yeah, they always bring in a friend. But I think, like, the I think they disguised it a little better in the first ones because you wouldn't, you wouldn't know it was going to be the mom doing what she was doing in the second one. Yeah. Unless you knew who she was. Her having a secret brother, he's doing all the... Yeah. You know, like, it, it was a little bit more disguised. But, like I said, going going off this, if I had to guess, the third one, one of them's going to have a secret family member that's going to want to do some of the killing. You if I, Like it. I said, if I'm doing the next one, I'm having her... I'm tired of the possession stuff. You're going to be possessed now. And you going after the main character. Okay. And now we gotta walk you off the ledge. Do we kill do we kill Ghostface? Or or do we do we snap her out of this hallucination? Well, you get that psychosis medicine, little, little. Yeah, we gotta walk her off the ledge. She gotta find a whole new therapist. She been had to have a, a whole new therapist. He was scared. <laughs> that man was scared. <laughs> he was scared. He was trying Rightfully to figure so. out. Rightfully so. She said, and he I like died killing. For it. She said, I like stabbing. <laughs> 
I stab and I stab and I stab and I like it. Hey. Yeah, she was crazy. <laughs> that was our reaction to Scream 6. Thank you to our 16,260 subscribers at the time of this recording. Thank you to Junior, Tyrell Grant, Chase Jones, Kenny the Inevitable, Halima Halima, 1966 Fastback, and JD Scopes for requesting this movie. Thank you to our patron, Trey John. Trey John. We appreciate you for being a patron. Thank you for being a patron.